in this session we are going to install obiarcg okay obiarcg this is my software rc software in this going for bin in the bin folder we are having rc yeah right click run as administrator Okay. Now we can see RC. Okay. In this window, you can click on next. Click on select create. And click on next. Write the uh, host name. My host name I have given as local host. Port number one five two one. Service name or CL. Host name is computer name. Sys database user name sys. Password is admin one two three. Okay. Now you can select this one. Okay. You can see three schemas are there. Click on next. Okay. Give the password and give the password as welcome one. Okay. Click on next. You can see your component. Okay. Component is there. Custom value here. We have the value. What is our value means? You can go for RC folder. In this folder. We have RCU. In this RCU, we have integration. In this integration, we have BL, uh, B apps. In that, we have the schema. In schema folder, you can see here. This we have to copy and we have to paste here. Okay. Now click on next. Okay, click on next. Okay, you can see this. Now click on next. Okay. Okay. Now the repository. Repository create and utility creating table space. Here you can see OBA, DMP, OBA, COMP, DMP, OBA, ODA, DMP. Okay. Let's take more time. After seven minutes, we can complete it. Click on OK. You can see. Okay. These are the table space names. Click on Create. Okay. It will create this one. Okay. OBAW, Oracle Business Business Application Components Repository, Oracle Integration Master and Work Repository, Execute Postgate Operations. Okay. Okay. OBIA RC Station has been. Completed. Okay. Click on close. In the next session, we are going to install OBIA. Okay.